In this video, I'm going to show you how to install the Momentum firmware onto your Flipper Zero. Hi, my name is Kyler Clark. I have over six years of experience in cybersecurity and I currently work as a full-time penetration tester, also known as an ethical hacker, and I'm here to help you grow your hacking and cybersecurity knowledge. Alright, so the first thing you want to do is plug in your Flipper Zero into your computer with a USB Type-C cable. Now you want to head over to Momentum dash fw dot dev and then come up here and click install as you click install it will ask you to connect we've already plugged our flipper zero into our computer so all i have to do is hit connect and it should detect our flipper zero this should be your flipper zero name so go ahead and click your flipper zero and click connect and then if you see this you should see what's going on in your flipper currently as you can see i have the old extreme firmware installed currently and it gives you some information about your flipper zero and then when you install momentum you have two options so you have the release version and you have the dev version so what's the difference between release and dev is dev is experimental release is the official release and the official release is always going to be more stable than the development version so if you want stability, which will be for most people, you definitely want to go release. If you want to test out some developmental features and you're okay with running into a bug or two, then maybe dev is something that you want to consider. Either one you choose, it doesn't matter. I'm going to go with release because I feel like that is probably the better one to go with if you're not trying to develop apps for the Flipper Zero. And then once you select a firmware, just click flash and that's pretty much it you'll see some progress bars going on here and that's basically all you have to do to install the momentum firmware so go ahead and give this some time and be patient it does take a few minutes to install momentum into your flipper zero while that's being installed do me a favor and hit the like button and subscribe for more hacking and cybersecurity content after a minute or two you'll see update in progress pay attention to your flipper and you should see this on your Flipper Zero. And then after a few minutes, you will see on your Flipper Zero screen and in your web browser, if you still have it plugged in, welcome to Momentum Firmware. So all we have to do is hit right to go next. And you can see it will give you some instructions on how this new firmware kind of works. So we can try, try pressing the up arrow key and then we can adjust volume and brightness, lefty mode, dark mode, Bluetooth, and just some overall information on how momentum works and then we can hit right again and then we can go ahead and get started as it says here and click OK. You're going to get something that looks like this unless you had previous firmware that made the GUI look different. I had to switch Flipper Zeros here because my other Flipper Zero still is using my GUI from the Extreme firmware which is fine. It still works the same but this is what it's going to look like as soon as you get momentum installed and you can see it has momentum specific features here and overall you are off the races and you're good to go once you see this now that you have the momentum firmware installed on your flipper zero you're going to want to start using it and if you don't know how to get started with your flipper zero you just need some inspiration on how you could use your flipper zero you definitely want to check out this video right here where i teach you nine different ways nine different hacks on how to use your flipper zero click and learn now